Something is different here. I'm getting, now I'm getting 23 frames per second. It seems like I'm getting a lot less drops and a lot better bandwidth operating as my uh, cell phone as a uh, <clears throat> hotspot. I got a notice from T-Mobile saying that they're upping my plan to a more T-Mobile based plan so I'm wondering did they somehow hear me or have they noticed my usage and they've changed a plan to something that's more usable because this whole trip I haven't had that much of a drop but then maybe uh, it could be too that I'm back in my 50 gigabyte cap so we'll see I don't know Americano with a little bit of cream and um, some uh, honey in it. Sure thing you want about hot, right? Yes, please. All right, anything else today? No, thanks. All right, 281 for you. Thanks. Okay, thank you. Break the ten yes. It is really smoky in the city today. <coughs> and I've lost my voice totally. I'm taking Stella to her appointment, <clears throat> and in the meantime, I'm going to get some coffee, coffee, I sound like I'm in the Mafia. Here we are, coffee. I'm going to shut up now, I sound awful. appointment for um, Stella to um, have her checked. Stella, come on. We're going this way. Come on. We're going into your favorite place. So Stella's doing well. She's going inside and getting checked. They say it won't be long. All right, Stella, I've come to get you out of jail. You're a jailbird. Oops, wrong side. Stella. That's because you've been licking again. Look, Jimmy's here to greet you, Stella. <laughs> uh, you remember, you got a cone on your head. So Stella's been given a new crown to wear for a while and some more antibiotics because she's been licking it. Her mama has been too permissive and letting her stay out of the cone. So the vet doesn't like that, but otherwise she's recovering fine. 
moving around good, so we just have to keep her cone on her. I have to be a little more strict about it. So if I can only get her mama to be strict and not feel sorry for her. Anyway, time to go home. I'm going to get my driver's license. It's my birthday next week and my time is up, so gotta do it. Mm -hmm. It seems I didn't come with the right documentation. And since I'm going for real ID, they want all this stuff. It's crazy. So anyway, I guess I'll go home and dig that up. Woohoo. Alrighty. Let's try this again. Oh boy. So much fun. <clears throat> I went home and dug up all this crap. Let's hope the line has died down. Looks like it has since uh, I came a little bit before lunch and I think everybody's taking their lunch hour to do this. Um, here we go. Wish us luck. Oh, uh, what a pain in the ain. Even with all those documents, I didn't have enough. I got it, finally. But only the driver's license. I couldn't get the real ID, which we need to travel after October on all domestic flights. They make it really hard. Everybody redacts your social security number on all your documents. They're afraid of getting sued for violating your privacy. And so none of my documents except my passport and my voter ID had my uh, my number on it, which sucks. So I gotta go find something else that has my ID number and come back, which is a bunch of you know what. Anyway, I'm gonna do something more pleasurable now. Oh, well, after having a fish fillet at Smack, see if I can, it's McDonald's that is. See if I can get out of here without bumping into everything. You know, stress eating. I have decided to come here and have some coffee. Coffee. <sighs> because that was not fun at the DMV. I tell you what. Hey. It's going. Coffee. We're breaking our, oops, routine a little. And we're here at Waffle House. Oh, that's for Saya. Too much for him. Mm. Can you put this on the side, please? Okay. The cake. Mm. Ketchup is sweet. You like sweet. This is good with ketchup. Brighten your burger, and of course, the pecan waffle. Mm. It was so good. I love Waffle House. And we don't forget about our doggies. Right, Jimmy? Right, Jimmy? Stella. <laughs> Stella's just enjoying the sun. And the grass. Lawrence, Kansas. We're here enjoying the nice day.
letting the doggos and the kiddos roam a little bit. We were trying to think of a place we could go that had shopping and outdoor recreation and I was like, let's go to Lawrence for the afternoon. And there's a train here hanging out at the station. Don't know what it's waiting for. <sighs> Such a beautiful day. At the Jayhawk. And kiddos who shouldn't be climbing on the Jayhawk. I love the uh, Winnebago Revel back here. But we're here in uh, Riverfront Park taking advantage of the, uh, the weather. Oh no, you might do cartwheels if you go out there. Oops. Here comes the energy. What's up? It's good. I want to fish. Yeah. Mm. No fishing. No fishing. Kansas River, from where the state of Kansas gets its name, or I believe it's actually Kansas Indians. It says this is a canoe portage only, but I think I can use this as a viewpoint as long as I don't fall in and get sucked into the dam. What do you think, Mr. Jim? Huh? What do you think? Oh, it says Bowerstock Dam, Portage Path, Takeout Only. Such a gorgeous day. There's a trail on the levee here, it runs for several miles. <laughs> Save some for the Corps of Engineers, Zach. First time in a long time I see a train on the other side of the river. They come around the bridge here. Look at that. You want to go over here and look at this art installation by Stan Hurd. And there's a view of the dam and there's like little shelters people have built down by the river. I don't know if they're living in them. I think they just did it for fun. I would hope because up until this past couple of weeks has been super cold. I wouldn't want to be by this river. Stan Hurd is known for his installations that can pretty much only be appreciated from the distance like from the air or whatever i think this one is over the years been eroded by flood waters and stuff i've always meant to come out here it's the first time i've ever come out here and looked at it up close let me swing around <laughs> So the sun is in my face and you can see the work behind me. But now I think we need to go back. Somebody has to go to the bathroom. It's a very friendly squirrel. Hi squirrel. Hi squirrel. Oh, very friendly. 
we are in one of my favorite alleys and uh, we're gonna go get some coffee coffee As we always do, we're here at our favorite ice cream shop, waiting outside because of the dogs. The dogs! Right, Stella? <laughs> Across from the beautiful Douglas County Courthouse, eating our ice cream. Mmm, ice cream. You do it next. Mm-hmm. In South Park. You gotta get everybody in. Yeah. Is everybody in? Can we say hi? Why is Saya turning her back to me? Saya! Oh well. There we go. <laughs> mm. Ice cream. Up on the gazebo. And I said how much of a beautiful day it is. Downtown Lawrence is so beautiful. Look at that sunset over there. A nice day has turned into a nice evening. A good time to stroll here. Well, we'll be on our way. Configuration number, I don't know, I've lost count. I've decided to try my, uh, what is this, F1000? I don't know what it is. Sony camcorder. I think in these situations, camcorder works better. And uh, hopefully we're ready to go. Um, I don't know where my headphones are, but I think it's working, so. As with one voice of praise, we acclaim. a bunch of helpers right now oh maybe I need to talk to father about something the rest of the day is going to the dongs isn't it is it somebody's birthday like somebody was born in February is somebody else was born in March wonder who that could be hmm letting El doggos run a little it's another beautiful day windy though Probably can't even hear this. Where are we going, dongies? Where are we going, huh? I think they know the way. That's right. Your favorite store. <laughs> What's this, Stella? Are we thinking about getting this, huh? Stella. Are we going to get it? Yeah. I don't know if the dogs even know it's her birthday. This is Jimmy's favorite part right here. It's 
sniffing the goods. We're here at this coffee house in the plaza. Lila the girly shop. And we got a birthday dog. Walking. Oh, that's good. And a bagel. Mm. And another one right here who doesn't look so happy with her hat. And we're having brunch at Taqueria. This is our crew. This has been a weekend of eating. But, ah, uh, yum. Hmm. <laughs> you come to a Mexican restaurant to eat American food there, Luke? <laughs> I don't think it's quite dead yet. I think that plate is bigger than you are, Zach. Yep. <laughs> I are satisfied. I think we are done here. Hey, birthday dongs. Where are you? Birthday dongs. Let's go home now, shall we? celebrating Mardi Gras. It's the doggie's birthday. Stella. I could be like this. Stella. And Stella looks so happy about it. Are you happy, Stella? You're wearing a princess hat. I think we know how Jimmy feels. It's like, why am I in this hat? You wait. Jim Jim. Can you... Jim Jim! Happy birthday, Jim Jim! Jim! You look so, so happy. You can get it. Let's put it close to Jimmy. Jimmy could have heard it. Okay. Okay, no. That's fine, that's fine. Oh, okay. You can lick it. Don't eat it. No! That's okay. No! I said he can lick it. He just ate it. Can you please wait? <laughs> <laughs>